We are hanging out with a renowned and an amazing, a vibrant, energetic gospel artist. Kama mnavyo wana, nitacha tu introduce and then we pick the show. Karibu sana. Asante sana. Mm -hmm. Yes, my name is Moji Shot Baba. Shoti Baba. <laughs> and I am, a, I am a Christian, I am a gospel artist and I am an all-round, I think, entertainer. Ah, uh, yeah, from Nairobi, Kenya. Mm. Right. Good to see you. And I'm happy to be here. Good to see you too. Yeah. <laughs> First of all, congratulations. Thank you so on much. On walking down the aisle yes. and finally saying I do. Maji. Una feel aje? I feel fit, kabisa. Uh -huh. uh, happy to be married to my, you know, to my best friend. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and happy to start that new journey. Okay. Yeah. Wow, I wish you all the best. Asante. Na life yako imi change aje. Na just say you me, umi ingi another category. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope so. I hope so. What we want to do is joke. But I'm happy. Uh, I don't know. I'm too happy for our next phase. I think adulting is enough for when you are like how like between the different stages in life. When it's time to be a child, when it's time to be an adult, to do adult stuff like getting married and starting a family. So I'm happy to be in your phase. Of course, kuna blessings like. Mm -hmm. So at least nyumbangu ina kuwa na food size. <laughs> As a bachelor, I can't tell you marangapi ni menda kupika ugari ni kapata ungangu ni expire. Oh. Because ya pika for a long time. So, mm -hmm. Na siya ti ya napika juu bibi ya nafaa kupika, ni juu yeah. anajua kupika na misi juu. So it works well. It's a good partnership. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Okay, she's also a beautiful girl. <laughs> Yes, she is. Yes. <laughs> Inside out. Inside out. I can yeah. confirm. Oh, you can confirm? Mm -hmm. Okay. So watch out to check you out. You wanna say my nini? Now on Ariana Rizona, I say my mitumba. I think that's one of your songs. Yes, that's one of my songs. <laughs> Neto mitumba. Yes. I'm gonna dance your feel. Uh huh. Come on, mitumba, mitumba. Ah. Uh huh. But I try and be a come a star god. I make up a chance. I'm gonna pick life. Sindo. And I'm gonna chance. Kila siku. Kila siku. Every time you, every time you wake up in the morning, it's a new chance mm. to do things right. To whatever. So God is a God of second chances. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alafu Samila Pura nasema itakuwa ngori. Much shout out to Moji Short Baba. Asante sana mzito. Mwisho wa story. <laughs> alafu Kendi Wanjiru anasema ngori. Yeah. Yeah, alafu kuna mwingine anaitwa Kalia anasema bus pals have done it again. Kale hapa sio kimao. Thank you so much for tuning in Kale and everyone else. You have a Yes. Unasema tucheze gospel one time uh -huh. every day. Hebu tuambie kwanza what was your inspiration? I think inspiration is just uh one mini fan of gospel music apart from being an artist. Mhm. Mm I music is a gospel music a lot and I know the power that gospel music carries in terms of it can encourage, it can teach, it can it can brighten somebody's day, it can lift somebody up on their low and stuff like that. And that's why I encourage people to just a gospel. And apart from that, this is an EP full of uh, you know energy and hyped up tracks because also the gospel is not boring. So this is a typical moji, you know, dance songs. There's even a reggae song in there. It's just a mixture of of, of good music that people can go and listen to on Boom Play, Apple Music, Spotify. <laughs> it's out everywhere, guys. So guys can go check it out. So basically, that's the whole idea behind the EP. And also, guys are consuming a lot of music now, you know, like never before. So that's why we're releasing EPs. Mm -hmm. Like that, so that guys can have uh, a good supply of, uh, of of some moji music. So yeah, and I'm excited about this project, and I'm happy, and I'm getting a good, I'm getting good response. Mm. Yeah. Quite the songs, Zawate. There are six of them. There are six of them. Yeah. Nigani, uh, your favorite? Ah, the song called Kameshika. Yeah. Yeah, it's a. Uh, we we love high energy music. Mm. I enjoy it. I keep perform. You know, I can't wait to release it. I can't wait for guys to like it, to listen yeah. to it and like it, and then start to perform. Mm. Yeah. And I think Pia, tuna kujua kwa songs zenye. Unajua msi akisikia, it's not boring. Kama, there's this song, it's called Vimbada. Yes, Vimbada. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, uh, I think, High energy, kila mtoi, anajua your song, exactly. everyone. Yeah. Exactly, and I'm happy. Yeah, yeah. but there's a deepness mm. in this Cheza gospel. Yeah. Okay, from what I've listened to. Yeah. What, what is different i feel like it's different from your other previous song yeah you think so yeah i feel like there's a i don't know <laughs> again uh -huh. i'm happy if you can notice that because of course the hope for every artist is that they grow mm. is that uh, if you listen to my music 
next week, next year, or next year, but one, or even six. Or if you listen to the next project that I'll release after that is a gospel, you can say, ah, there has been, there has been gradual growth. growth. Yeah. So I'm happy to hear that. Okay. Yeah. I love you. Najwa, ukisema to chase a gospel banner. Unadani wa Kenya wana chase a gospel enough. Are we doing enough? In fact, what's our gospel? What's our opinion of gospel? What's our opinion of gospel? Tuko kwa challenges, ka gospel and whatever. But what's our opinion of gospel? But ni mwenye mwenye sema. It's not a question of if gospel music ina chase enough, or if it's not a question of what's our chase a gospel music or chase chase other songs. It's a question of where chase a gospel. You know. Mm. They just make sure at any one time we chase a gospel because there is power. In real gospel music there is power. So the the nini is yo, if you feel encouraged, discouraged, if you feel, you know, sometimes you know, if you want you need to be rebuked and stuff like that, I'm sure there's a gospel song somewhere. Ataka see a moji shot baba and you need to fit your situation. Mm. So chase a gospel. Mm. Plus it's clean, you know, it's clean music. <laughs> you can listen to gospel music with anybody, with your mother and I'm dance and put to fit it. Mm. Yeah. That is very true. Yeah. yeah. Now na Lucy Kapumpu and I say we love your songs Buddha. <laughs> Sante Lucy Kapumpu. Yeah, love. Kendi Wanjiru wa make up to love hearts. I think pia anapenda mziki yako. Sante sana. Na Anwangoi anasema nitabaki hii pande niona nina Yesu. For sure. Mm. Wewe kama gospel artist, yeah. ni role gani una play to make sure you know like vijana wanasikiza mziki yenye venye umesema ni clean. Mm. Mm-hmm. I think um when well, this is saying in a similar change in anza na wewe. Mm-hmm. So I think for me si kukwambia si ufai kuambia si sana than to make sure wewe mwenyewe una supply wa same ziki. Mm-hmm. So it's not a question of how much what I can what I can say it's if you if 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 I say it I can back it up with music. Okay. So saying kiambia mse okay cheza gospel na can tell him yo I have a full EP six songs ndo hizi hapa skiza hata moja kila siku every week uh, every every day of the week sunday ni mkoe ni mkoe chia ni mkoe chia you know uskize chibalonza and whatever uh. Uh, so it's it's a matter of what am i doing when you ask what am i doing i think it's really making sure there's enough gospel music out there mm. so is it collaborating with other guys is it helping other guys write songs is it me steadily releasing music consistently Yes, that's what I'm doing. Mm. Yeah. Speaking of releasing music consistently, yeah. Yeah. which you really have. Yeah. Like I don't think kuna mwaka inaishanga kama hatujasikia track kutoka kwako. Yeah. yeah. Ume maintainage your consistency. Um I, I think you're not tied down to one, you know. For me this is this is this is this is most of what I do. Muziki na gospel music na huduma. So nisipoifanya, you know, hakuna kitu nafanya. Unless it's under there, you just come to participate in music. Just be sure, I've moved on to something else. Maybe mm. God has, God has directed me towards something else. But as long as I'm doing music, you know, I know you. Can you point here? Unataka you give it your all. You give it your all. So at the end of the day, usiwai kwa na any coming back to yourself and saying, oh my God, I wish I could get to more music. So for me, to more music, more music, more music to supply people. Ili kitu nye goda mega nani yangu ni ikamuwe kabisa. So I think that, and of course, na pena tu job mi pia, na pena tu job. Na sikia katu, ah, <laughs> you know, tufanya tu kazi. Wajua, let's just do something, and then God is gonna bless us in his own way. So for me, pia spendi kuzu bazu ba. Na andi kamziki mingi, wacha itoke. Wacha yende wa sit. Wacha yende wa sit. Usi waste time. Kuje pals, tuiskume, to the studio, tufanya ingine. Ukweli. And that, repeat. Until, again, until life pushes you. You know, life, life ina kwa gana different stages. Life, you grow na, you know, ina kwa na other things. So, uneza pata, you know, maybe later, because mu fanya a lot of things in entertainment. So, uneza pata, maybe in a few years, you know, my mind or my heart might be, doing something else but at this my particular moment ni kwa kwa muziki but i hope i i always do music i like creating it yeah mm. Mm. unajua as a gospel artist eh muziki ni biashara yeah. na pia ni huduma yeah. ni ministry yeah as at a personal level yeah. how do you draw that line yeah you know ministry like if it were say yeah. na bado hii ni hasoli yako yeah mm. well i think ministry pia inaanza you know ministry ko sana kwa the kind of music na toa kind of writing na toa inaanza hapo ufuata mm-hmm. tuingie kwa whether ntaenda mali nilipwe au nitafanya free inaanza kwa can the songs themselves minister mm-hmm. mtia kisikiza kwa youtube ama kisikiza somewhere else so that's where ministry starts ministry starts 
I'd, I will not compromise the content of my music or the content of whatever I do mm -hmm. for for gain. Really like ni sebe okay, wacha ni fanyiki tundi watu wakasiriki and then you know. So in a ministry inazi hapo inazi way before to fikia kwa gig. Ikifika ni kwa gig, ikifika kwa hizo places, you know, one kuna places zenye for sure msia na kuita ndiyo way ya gain. Either pesa, mm. ama, it's, ama it's a promotion, ama stuff like that. Then there you have to do it because it's your gaining. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you understand? Yeah. Um, there are places where there are certain churches, you know, there are certain churches that we can use for free. There are certain churches that have those that, that can be able to appreciate the artist. Mm. Because um, if it's a church program, then kuna fa kwa kitu pia ya facilitate that program for the person who's coming to facilitate it and that you know could be me in certain in certain world. so it's a good it's a balance that you have to strike in terms of see you everywhere you go as a minister you'll be able to be given what you what you want mm -hmm. yeah leo unaweza perform gig you'll be given so it's not everywhere you expect a certain thing and it's not everywhere kuna places in you know na mungu na utaget whatever treatment ama hata quote and quote payment or appreciation in nataka so kusema tu kweli in a very to sound very christian god has to lead you <laughs> ah. yeah god has to lead you god has to lead you feel kuna place utaitwa hata kuna place hata unaweza itwa na domo sana na god akwambiezi amu feel akwambiezi you shouldn't be there na hautaenda yeah yeah, yeah. cuz over time we will learn mm -hmm. when i have gone na nimesikia hiyo kitu things probably go wrong mm -hmm. you understand when i feel like oh like like uje kama uje your your whole experience of a person. Uh -huh. Have you ever made a decision with your mind, but your your spirit in a but mm -hmm. your mind like a pana, but in a kind of And then you get there, you're like, and I felt it. I felt it. I <laughs> knew it. I should have trusted my guts. You yes, know. yes, yes. <laughs> but sometimes people expect like the voice of God will speak like you know with thunder. No, 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 no. He speaks through you. It's so true. and you can tell any even in the simplest things. Like something told you, si toke, uka toka, uka edo, uka ibiwa sivu, uka ibiwa kiatu, uka juliza, why did I go? What? Ama sometimes you're trying to do something and you know it slaps you with a no, like in a kata, in a kata, but Yeah, yeah but you keep, you keep forcing it and you keep, you keep, you keep uh, incurring losses, mm. you keep... So I feel like when, when people say God spoke to me or God, mm. or, I, I, or I expect, or if God speaks to me and stuff like that, people... Tana say what we want like when I can keep dramatic, whereas in a very funny way, pure mungu kuongelesha. Only that to tie term wa kuki kuita kasauti, yeah, kura kitu ni ambia yuki to nani. You know that and our mothers, our mothers and our parents who are, you know, mostly mm. in an Africa setting very spiritual, mm. they take that voice very seriously. So they'll tell you, by the way, mm. usiende. Usiende. Oh, by the way. So yeah, so yeah, go, go, when it comes to like the business aspect and whatever aspect we are, God is very, very, very central mm. in making sure that how kose how kosi kosa kwa mali. Because you know, even in business, I don't know story of Huduma and Moji Shot Baba and Huduma and Ministry. Mm -hmm. Even in business or whatever, there are certain opportunities that might not give you monetary gain, but will be able to open certain doors. Mm. You, you get so you, yeah. yeah. So if you, we should we should scare what we say. Ma, see, ni ni amani ni simu tuata na fanya Huduma amani ni, but what we say ma, tweet na ni. Allah for what we say ma, we sit and we tuata penda pesa sa. <laughs> I'm sure we can go to Kenya. Uko like, yeah. by the way, to look at Mlipe. Mm. Lakini bado hata muita because ana penda pesa sana. Because yeah. ameka pesa mbele, mbele. sana. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> yeah, Ni mongeza. <laughs> Usidali mongea points. Wacha tuone wase wanasema nini. Ah, uh, Tito Titus anasema tunafanana moji paka hiyo mm. ufupi. Ai ai ai. Mshoe mshoe. Ati mshoe cheze kama yeye. <laughs> Sijui tumwambia tumepita. Kama mimi kudu. Ati tumepita basi. Eh yeah, alafu kuna msi anaitwa takatakatifu anasema ako locked thank you so much for tuning in alafu Trisha Maria anasema ah, niko free mode but mgote sana na umwambie nampenda sana nuno bundles nuno bundles mse <laughs> yeah kuna msi amekugotea asante sana mse god bless mm. alafu speaking of how you were brought up mm. kuna video nilicheki you were you know you were dancing with your grandma yes what role has she played in your music and yeah you know your growth as a person 
Um, okay, so <laughs> me, my, my mom got me young, so uh, well, if I'm a tag team, I show show. Earlier on, so mm. I was raised by my mom, Shushu, and my aunts. So mm. my Shushu has always been very integral. So, um, you know, I understand and I've had friends who Shushu are quite a bit far from them. So mm. my Shushu has been very close and is still very close even now. So the role that she has played in my music is being very, her being very grounded in the word. Mm -hmm. You know, when we have conversations, I pick up stuff. Uh, when we are talking, of course, other me being a Christian, she has played such a big role. So even now, you know, Part of my thinking, part of how I think, part of how I approach certain things, mm. um, is Shosho. Yeah, she is a great influence on my channel. Ah, okay. Yeah. That's, that's lovely. To mm -hmm. say hello to Shosh Penyako. Uh, yeah, yeah. Eh. Yeah. 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 Anaku Sita, Ebu Neza Kimbia, Shiva Gospel. Yeah, your specific song. Yeah. Eh. Kiasi. Kiasi too. Mr. TJ, play me some gospel. Ah, Mr. TJ, play me some gospel. You want to a po 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 ne? I do a po 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 ne po ne. Ziki ni da, na Yesu ndio da. Ziki wa Yesu, am Ziki wa power. Yes. Hey, amen. Ziki wa power, Sindio. Yeah. Yes. I love you, Sasa. There's some things you shared. Yeah. That you don't know about you. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Hey, mm. Actually, you've kept your beard for how long? For a long time. For like <laughs> last time I shaved, all of it was like 2014. That's how long ago? <laughs> it's like uh, seven years now. Seven years now. Yeah. Wow. So how how do you maintain it? Uh kuna mafuta ya beard, then you napaka. Uh kuna kuna maybe a beard wash. Na basically, kwa na tu kunyolewa, na kumikisho everything is okay. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, what we're gonna do, please? Now, anointing all people on the paka kias. Just to keep it holy. Anointing only in a side, yeah, na. Just to keep it holy. It's a prayer thing. Kwa to all 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 so the same way you'd, you'd maintain your hair on your head, you have to maintain this yeah. hair. Mm -hmm. And this is more sensitive because it's on your face. Ah, yeah. yeah, so it, that's the first thing you see. <laughs> in your honor. So imagine if it's, if it's not clean, if it's dirty, if it's not moisturized, just mm. everything. Yeah. 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 And me, when I was growing up, I used to fear guys with beards. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they are nice guys. But they are scientific. They have done a, a, a study. Really? Yeah, yeah. And me, I would see guys for with beards. There's it's by Machakos University. No, no. I'm just joking. <laughs> 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 also, you told us you're very shy. Yeah. I don't feel like you're shy. I feel like you're. Is it a bubbly? I don't know if you can describe a bubbly. Yeah, like bubbly I, I, I describe it. you as vibrant you know, you and energetic. Be, you know, you can be. Yeah, but you can be all that. But it's still mm. be shy. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
maybe you work like well you are shy and then you're here you work here mm. so utafanyaje hizo interview kwa like why watu jinga come out <laughs> like in there are so many people i know who are still shy even to this point and they are artists and in the public domain they just shy they just shy yeah, yeah. So, so and that has put me in a lot of trouble though why because when i meet people <laughs> mm-hmm. in certain places you go supermarket or whatever see i'm just me i'm i'm chilling mm. guys think i'm i'm a snob yeah me first of all i think you always you know yeah hey, you know, know, you 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 know, cheza gospel yeah. ndio nimesema it's very very different yeah. eh, kuna gani nyingine nasikia kuzitoka kuzitoka hizo titles unatoa wapi itakuwa uh-huh. ngori eh itakuwa ngori baba baya <laughs> it's a uh, uh, i don't know it's a language in mucha go it's how i package my art what i'm saying hivyo eh the way from my, even the name shot baba it's like everything should be eye catching but bado iko na content so no kwa like you know mituma afu you is like trying to think out of the box fikira ish mitumba you try kuimba juu ya chance ya pili uzinga how do i get to chance ya pili chance ya pili chance ya pili maybe like in your song to get cuz una joke angalia title unaona mitumba but like when you listen to the message si hizi ni zile ngoma za gospel hizi si hizo ngoma wanaimba ga hizi hakuna kitu wanasemanga sana Yeah, but last trick because kids are not like yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, like, there's, there's something yeah. this guy saying. Eh, jumitumba pia zimepewa. Yeah, second time. Ah, hapo ulifikiria, hapo, hapo ulifikiria. Okay, okay. I love generally by the how do you describe like your fans? Unaona wa fans, ma fans wako ni watu aina gani? Wewe venye unafikiria? Ma fans wangu ni wase tu. I think fan wangu ni mtu tu wa kawaida, mtu tu simple mtu wa kawaida. Eh, na kulingana na wale wasomsalimia na watu wii na watu wengi. Eh wale watu mafans wangu kuna mafans wangu complicated lakini most of those complicated fans wangu sophisticated. Hawajanipenda hao wenyewe. Ni watoto <laughs> wao. Oh ni watoto watu wao wamefanya. Wao wa force. Ah. Yeah. Okay. But yeah your song is very in a ring to come mind. Unajua? Yeah. It's yeah. yeah, yeah. like that. Ni simple. Yeah. Speaking of watu wao kuna hii mm. project umeko kidu Baba for the kids. First yeah. of all, I just like that name. You like that name? <laughs> thank, yeah. you, thank you so much. Yes. Mm. Ebu, tell us about it, what inspired it na future projections that you Ah, uh, Baba for the kids basically yani kwa sama muji shot Baba for the kids. So mm-hmm. is it inspiring them? Is it empowering them? Is it educating them on different things? Is it helping out where we can? So basically it's a uh, it's like a uh, that Baba for the kids is like a uh, it's like a mother and then it's going to have so many other children hapo katikati so <laughs> baba for the kids is going to have children um, <laughs> it's going to have so many projects za watoto so kuna kuna uh, projects za za kusaidia uh, kuna projects za entertainment for children mm-hmm. yes and that one that one that's the one we really want to roll out i think later on this year to see what we can make because we've been making content for everybody but then it resonates with children mm-hmm. so how can we make content for children and stuff like that san mi moji mwenyewe so i think uh, guys should watch out for that so that's it and we 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 partnered with some other guys to do also child protection like earlier on this year we partnered with uh, uh with Amref mm-hmm. Amref Kenya and UNICEF to sensitize guys on the need to protect our children so we're also talking about in that project we're talking about like the child helpline yeah. it's a number that people can call and you know in case in case you in case there's a child around you that is being abused or they need help there's a number it's actually 116 and it's toll free so utali picho kitote so basically you know us doing projects and also working with guys that have interests in that area mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. growing up yes eh uh, grow up to nairobi yeah. tatuambia ni wapi yeah. i love can you describe yourself as a kid describe myself as a kid yeah. i was a very 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 what are say very 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 another thing so when you come to tumtundu I was mm. a very very polite child really real. <laughs> with all that energy ah. the energy you talk about i think it came later in life me got me bottle up so much kalipuka but i was a very polite child mm. naturally spend it with mchezo rafraf mimi so leave pia tu wamepanda mti mpaka uko juu akaruka akavunja mgu but they have never they even jata like a bone whatever mimi mwenyewe out of my own ufala but umeanguka 
kila mtu anguka. Kwanza kwanza nilianguka nikiwa mtoto sana ile kuanguka tu na tembe unajitega unaanguka. Mpaka yeah. nikauliza Mungu mimi uko ni ndio uliamua this is this is the way my life is going to go naanguka. But anyway, I was a very polite child. Mm. Growing up in Dagoreti. Dagoreti constituency. That is a uh, area za Gando, area za Kaongware. Mm-hmm. That's my area. Mm. Yeah. All right. Kuna mse hapa anaitwa Wanjiru anasema you so funny. <laughs> <laughs> you too. Yeah, I love it Daniel anasema keep it bro locked until okay, yeah. until the end. <laughs> until the end of the show, keep it locked here. I love pia ulisema you can't swim. I can't imagine. So tukikutupatu kwa ocean it's done deal. That's me. I'm Why? Going, I'm going, that's how I go out. I can't swim for whatever reason. I've never really like paid attention to land. I can just mm-hmm. learn a few moves hopefully mm-hmm. by oh. the end of this year. Cuz in some of the time nataka ku turn 30, one of the main things nataka kufanya mm-hmm. ni kujua ku ride motorcycle na kuswim. Mm. So I'm really working on it I have a few months. So see if you have water or a large no, masses. No, no, no. There's nothing like. Ni venye tu it was never Ah uh, yeah, you to you've never really gotten like to do it. I don't know. You've never had the interest. <laughs> Mimi bado cha kwa mimi kasi na interest ya kitu and that's I think PA yeye niaka in a lot of trouble kasi na interest ya kitu mimi si kwa hapo au kwa hapo eh my mind is shut down it's, it's a problem creatives have what's the weirdest thing you have interest in the weirdest thing i have eh, interest in yenye msa kisikia kwa la um i don't know man but i like watching very weird documentaries about weird things you know <laughs> the weird things like like i don't know about small can like there's a time we were watching how people eat rats in nigeria yeah, you know, that's weird that's <laughs> as in i just watch i just watch very informative videos of just like random random things. stuff yeah, like rats like eh, ran, like, eh, like food in whatever jamaica mm. like crime in bolivia those kind of things yeah i guess uh, I, 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 know, i know my wife probably i am me am more of like nikita like your youtube i'm just watching different things because i like to explore and see what I've, what's what's happening over there what's happening over there what's happening over there mm-hmm. also ni akili ya msani hivyo need to feed it to like information and stuff like that i don't yeah. know but you are just a usani you are just you are just me me guess interest you, yangu muta kuna weird documentaries about <laughs> you know crazy things like what's happening in congo like there's like even judizo by the way Nini ni kwa Kongo end of the documentary takuona mm. what happens yeah, stuff like that so utaenda huko ngi kuso food that's how i realize eh, rats na kuliona lakini asita go rats na asita grass cutters oh my now i know una tu ni zenda nigeria la form like grass cutters but not at in nigeria it everywhere it's just a part of nigeria i think oh. sijuni wapi huko yeah. grass cutters grass cutters so weird name so even related to rats she's in a pita konyasi <laughs> Ah, hata nyoka huko inakatwa na inachomwa one time. Ah. What's the strangest thing umekula? What's the strangest thing they say kula? Ah. Ai, sasa mimi sija kula vitu mo weird. I'm not Umezi a mukula na macho yangu. Mimi sasa ni mukula na macho. Hapo kwa documentary. Ah ah, mukula na macho in terms of um say you eat your eyes normally. If something looks funny I won't eat it. Oh you you like nothing. It looks eh uh, looks uh, looks weird. I won't eat it. I don't know man. Like ni sija kula a lot of crazy thing. I think nilena mali hizo vile zimdu kula nyama ya crocodile. I think that's maybe the weirdest thing nishai kula. Ah. Nyama ya crocodile. But crocodile meat is sweet. Yeah. Yeah. You guys should try. <laughs> <laughs> We are here giving recommendations of crocodile meat anyway. Um So with COVID-19 and the whole lockdown in the way, you know, it's been up and down since last year. Mm. What has been the biggest challenge for you as an artist? I think it, it I think it it disrupted a lot of I think work. <laughs> Now this challenge is is to not to work as you were used to. Mm-hmm. Yeah, tuko kuna vinyo tukomeza kufanya kazi. Eh ni kama sasa shop imefungwa. Basically, the market imefungwa. You're not performing, you're not you're not doing things as and you know you know when everybody when when the economy suffers you know so many things suffer campaigns there are different products and stuff like that events yeah. so we can't travel outside the country True. or it's not so easy kulikuwa na hata mimi had events even outside the country so they were most of them were just they were cancelled yeah, cancelled so okay zilikuwa zinapushwa forward until i realized oh man 
<laughs> the curve was really normal. So I think <coughs> not, not working or not being not being able to work, not being able to do things as we are used to, mm -hmm. that has been the biggest challenge for, for artists like me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, we may survive. Do you know what I'm saying? I'm saying, I'm I don't think farmer and as a cooler as a is cooler than bego. Hmm? Even when kuna kujua ime waka kabisa, mm -hmm. a farmer must have seed to plant. Mm. Right? So it's like ni kiacha kutoa mziki, ni kama that's my seed. Oh yeah. If I'm not working, if I'm not doing media tours, if I'm not doing all these things in a manisha, eventually when the rain comes what will I have? There'll be nothing. Because <laughs> <laughs> so, one day, you know, our hope is that one day things will go back to normal. Yeah. Like you want to tell me, like, like a short baba, I'll get a girl happy. Lazima to maintain relevance, you know, at the end of the day. Yeah, Lazima, you still have to, you still have to continue doing, uh, you still have to continue releasing music, because your fans are there, and they're still consuming it, and they're still going through stuff. Mm. So, you want to come at their point of need, Wakati tulikuwa na stress, ulikuwa na fact tulikuwa mziki, tutuwe ze kusikia vizuri, alafu pia uka potea. So unapabala, pia unapabala, unapabala, maybe you might not release vile inafama, venye you would have done it before, but you still have to continue. Yeah, yeah. at the end of the day. Yeah, muko knock down lakini, amja kuwa destroyed. Mm. Yeah. Okay, I'm also curious to know, mm. do you think in Kenya we have gospel artists who are just doing this music for money? Yeah. Mhm. Mm I kosa. <laughs> I don't know them maybe, but I kosa. Mhm. Mm I and, I and I think honestly, um it's not it's not an excuse for people to be imperfect. But I was you can't look for perfection evil. At least a kukwe hakuna. That's mm -hmm. kukwe now. Mm -hmm. You know. Ama kuna za kwa na gospel artist wenye at certain points wamefanya hivyo maybe hata mimi you know maybe yeah. kuna a point yenye maybe mko like yo man i really need money you know mm. you get so i think there's no there's no perfect person the perfect person is jesus according to us yeah. when you meme christo so i wouldn't say that it's it's i think kwa hivyo it's so weird it's so like oh my god <laughs> Oh my God! It's, it's a surprise. Man. No, like yeah, it's me kuapo. I'm at certain points. I'm say we gino me kuwa pulled to the side. I'm me kuwa pulled to the end of Karudi. Cause I say when I'm back at gospel, they must be na dam when you wanna fit the same issues everybody wanna go to. Like that you do for their children, that you rent, that you all these things. So certain points, I'm saying I feel a certain way. I'm saying I have certain needs. I'm saying I have certain dreams, peer, certain ambitions, and stuff like that. So it's not it's not an excuse, but I I wouldn't even say that me maybe at some point they should be Yeah, I think the mistake is when you say ma, no jo atuna chukulianga as if they are perfect. Yeah, and they're supposed to act in a certain way, but well, it's a responsibility to us that we are in the limelight mm -hmm. to be extra careful and to know that whatever we do in angaliwa. Yeah, but then again, to this other side, yeah, was when you to angalia. Don't expect perfection. Mm -hmm. Expect somebody to try. A try. Like mine is to try. You didn't even have to do that, you know. Yeah. But I wouldn't come here and say, Mimi, I'm a perfect gospel artist just because maybe in a certain it's a certain situation. Not nobody is perfect. No one, not even one, mm -hmm. apart from Jesus. Kuna time kwa life for my fika uka feel you've been pushed to the corner. You're like, can I just jump? on this other side or let music go all together when I'm, this other side i mean secular secular or let this music go all together i think music go all together and shake up uh -huh. for honestly and i'm not perfect i'm not i'm not i'm not better than anybody but i've never had that ninia uh, kusema naenda secular i've never sije ifika hapo but ya kusema ni acha na muziki ni shaifika yeah shaifika eh kwa time una feel maybe things are not working you know but like i eh Mana, if I do something else, I'm going to do for something else, I'm whatever. Yeah, and I'm a fika. If my mother mom, yeah, I'm a Ah, so you know, you can't be a quitter. It's cock. I mean, even forging forward. And you know, it's just being honest. It's just mm -hmm. being honest. Like, yeah. you can stand here and say, every day I wake up, 
niko strong no not to... <laughs> nah <laughs> it's only god who gives us the strength to overcome mm. certain things you run to god you're like man up and down yeah. sometimes it's even hard to talk to god you know maybe your heart maybe your walk is not strong and stuff like that so it's a lie and, and i think that lie if you believe it you can be broken because when you're discouraged then you think like it's the end of the world like nobody else has ever been discouraged kawe yeah you get and that's mm. why you, feel, you you hear guys doing very extreme things or going to like very extreme lengths au jiwa na ushikwa na msee amepitia the same thing umepitia but yeah amechukua ni kama ni kama yani dunia imeisha kama ameshutiwa you get like z me by that i mean last week you know nilikuwa tu hapo nilikuwa hapo mali ulikuwa and stuff like that so i think in this in this journey called life mm-hmm. everybody will reach at that point and that's when you know that's why we have god that's why we have the holy spirit that's why it's important to always pray it's important always to be in fellowship it's important to always have guys around you who can tell you who can encourage you who can pull you up who can tell you oh, by the way sawa tuko hapo kwa hiyo lakini things will be okay but time is akuwa discouraged i never danganyana sana uongo kupo sana hapa si kwa discouraged sana pengine jana liko discouraged mm. yeah, but you shouldn't eh uh, you could if i could cripple you get mm. you should should rise up and move eh na mungu ndo anatupea hiyo strength ya ku rise up kweli yeah mm. Pastor Moji shot me back. Nakwambia <laughs> we're tuma sliding kito, into the world. <laughs> tuma kitu kwa past life. Ah. <laughs> 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 eh, hey, okay, Wanjiru seems to be like your number one fan and asema good motivation. Thank you so much. Right Wanjiru. there. Eh, hey, na kuna Ian Wagema anasema kelele takatifu. Ah, saini Moji shot. Eh. Hey. <laughs> Alisha toka huko solo artist you should by the way, you guys you should check out his songs and then muneza if you have questions you can ask him ako hapa leo hanging out with us aki to encourage and atwambia kila mtu anakuanga na time yenye anakaribia kufika hapo kuna ma collab umefanya kadhaa na um, musicians from Kenya internationally who are you I you know given the chance yeah you'd be like me this guy tukutane to studio uyu uh, unaweza tafanya i don't know uh uh eh i think there so many artists like i don't know akina traffic green all those guys the guys we watch the guys are, i wonder how it would look some guys mm. from nigeria and stuff like that mm. so the guys i'm i and the guys already like to not know yeah so soon and very soon eh yeah. ma, ma collabs sawa sawa yeah. we are waiting we corona we corona <laughs> To, we are waiting we are yeah. eagerly waiting so as we as we wrap up the show yeah what is the one thing that you know when you live here today you would want your fans to remember or when you're doing your music yeah what is it that nimesikiza cheza gospel vimbada ni nini unataka kama your fan ama your listener of the song nikwe nakumbuka i think i think one at the hata kama kuna any i don't know uh, i feel like uh, uh, when people see me sometimes they're like ai wewe we, we. nei wenda wote umeokoka nei mwandishi wote uko kwa mungu i think it's just to tell guys that it's okay to be who you are and also be christian and be unapologetic about it and and be who you are like who you are doesn't have to be something that pushes you away from god yeah and i guess you know and i guess I, i i represent that fully like i can be fully me i can never draw jokes and like mm. as a co fan my music and stuff like that but still you know be every, still have god at the center so it's very important for guys to know that yo you still have to you know you can be you and you know you i think this generation has said being you is being rowdy or doing the wrong thing and yo that's me yeah you get i think you is a personality and a person that God created you to be. Yeah, and your, flows, you to be. And, and your flows and imperfections. And your flaws and imperfections. Yes, yes, yes. That God wants you that way so that mm. you can make you better. Na he can make you better, use you for his glory and also, you know, make sure that whatever he has put in you in the talker, whatever ingredients ali yakanda ni yako zinaweza changanywa vizuri na zitoe something beautiful. So, I think guys will always remember should always remember that that yani Mungu mbele kwa kila kitu. Amen. Yeah. Wow, I love that. Yeah. Haya kumbusha watu 
about your new EP, Songs Zote. Hi guys, it's Moji Short Baba, and I'm here at Pulse. And I'm here to tell you that I have a new EP out, six songs, all for you. It's on Apple Music, on Boomplay, on Tidal, it's on YouTube, it's on uh, Deezer, on whatever platform, Mdundo, whatever platform, Gamziki, Eco, go stream, go buy, go follow me at Moji Short Baba if you need any other additional information, Kama Jana Nilikulanini and stuff like that. I don't know. <laughs> you can holler at me. Asante ni sana. Wow, yeah. thank you. Yeah, thank you everyone for tuning in. Make sure that you check out Moji Short Baba song. Na tucheze gospel. Let's support our gospel artist yeah. in Kenya. And you pia o watu wendele kutupatia mziki safi na mziki poa. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you again next time. Bye.